Hello friends, in this video we learned that how can we use wood clipper video editor and it is absolutely free. So you have to search wood clipper download in your web browser and then hit enter then it will take you to this page you have to click on this first link and uh, and then you have to click on this uh, latest version button and then it will start downloading after that you have to install your file now like this your wood clipper application will open and then here you have to select the ratio of your file like this one and then it will open like this so for adding a file you have to click on this import then import files then words means any uh, video you want and then it will take a while to import so I have two videos here but I want only birds.mp4 so how can we remove this video or if you have an image then you can also remove the image by this method so you have to right click on the video and then choose this remove option and then the video will be removed from there now to add this video in your timeline you can dra uh, simply drag it or you can click on this add button like this and then you, it will ask you this question you can uh, answer it or you can uh, simply close it now it will open like this so first thing we learn to do is how can you split the video you have to place this line from where you want to split the video and then choose this uh, scissor button or this split button then it will be splitted you can see that my video is splitted in two parts now after split we learn that how can we zoom into the video so first you click the video then paste the line after which you want to zoom and then click on this zoom button and then select the area to which you want to zoom like this area now see it will look like this so if you want to increase the length of the zoom you have to select the zoom box and then uh, choose this length button and then you can uh, increase the duration okay now see the duration is increased Now after zoom there is crop so let me split the video one more time and now how can we crop the video like this is uh, here I have want to crop now you have to select the area to which you want to crop like this area at the mouth of the bird and say ok this is blurred image that's why it's look like this so i have undone the crop because it's not looking uh, so good so if you want to increase and decrease the size of this timeline means like this you can do by cho uh, choosing this button from here now you can see here it will look like this now how can you mute any video you have to select the video and right click on it and uh, choose mute from here and from here also this one mute so the background music is removed from this video now after crop we learn that how can we uh, add some text here in the video so you have to click on this text button and then you can choose uh, which text you want or you can uh, choose this add subtitle button and then you have to type this text which you want like words and then you can increase and decrease the size of this video
like this and then if you want to increase the size of text you can do like this and now if you want to add it, the text you have to choose the text box and then subtitle sub -tile style and then you can choose from here and you can choose opacity and color from here you can uh, increase and decrease the size of text it is the uh, largest side, uh, size and then you can uh, choose the font from uh, the top and then you can uh, say ok for saving the setting of the text so like this you can add text in your video now After text, we learned that how can we edit this video by uh, using this button. So select the video and uh, choose this button, edit button. You can, uh, from here you can control the speed of this uh, video like this. And if you want to give the normal speed, then you can uh, choose this button. And then you can also rotate the video like this. And then you can also scale the video like this and you can also position it so then in color mix you can choose the color uh, like contrast saturation brightness RGB sharpen dark corner so you can choose any one from these options and then there is beauty you can give her buffing you can give her highlight you can give her ready you can give her facelift eye zoom etc etc then there is dynamic like uh, from here you can choose rotate so first you have to download uh, this effects and then double click on it to apply and then you can see how it looks let me show you one more time from starting see Now see how the video comes. So like this you can and you can also give her effect duration. Then there is color king. King. You can also do this and then audio. You can give her. Um, you can increase the volume of the audio. And then you can save it like this. So now, after this, we learned that how can we uh, use the special effect options from here. Now I'll select this video. Uh, this is splitted video, and then uh, go to special effect. You can add any effect from here, like this one, spotlight, and uh, it will look like this. Firstly, let me increase the size of it. Now, see. How this spotlight effect uh, sees. You can see how it looks, and then there's transitions. You have to click on this button, and then you can choose the transition you want, like this one or this one. It is here in the end, but I don't want it here. I want it here, so I can simply drag it like this. Like this. Now see this transition.
Let me close this. Let's see. Now it's a uh, very uh, small in size, so let me increase it. Now, okay. So it will see uh, slowly. I don't want it. So like this, you can uh, insert here any transition, like uh, uh, this one. You can uh, give his scroll uh, right, anyone from here. Now see how it is. So. After transition, there is filters. You can also give her any filter like color difference. You firstly have to download it, then you can uh, insert it in your uh, video. Now see, this is the effect means filter of this color difference. Then uh, after filters, there is overlays, and in overlays there are many options. You can choose anyone from here like this one, yellow bubble, purple bubble, and this one you can see how it looks so like this you can add here overlays and then there is animation so you can choose any animation you want from here like this one which is happy rabbit first you have to download it then you can use it now let me delete this from here if you want this animation over here first you have to split the part where you want it and then uh, you have to drag it over here now see how this animation looks like see so if you want this animation over here you can also do this let me delete this from here now select the animation drag it to this uh, second track like here I want it and then you can uh, place it You have to double click on uh, the animation here and then it will be selected then you can place it where you want then say okay now see how this animation will look like here you can see that here's the animation so after animation there is music here are many music you can add like this one listen it to it So this is the music now I if you want your own music here you can also add it uh, you have to go to sources then import import files and it is in uh, this one this folder and then you can use anyone from here like this one and you can listen it and uh, then you can add it the track you can also place it where you want now uh, here our videos end so I will uh, split this uh, song from here so split and then now so like this you can add your own music here and if you want to control the volume of the music you have to double, uh, double click on the music or you can select the music then you can say add it and now you can increase uh, decrease the music like this it is um, this one now see you can see a little music uh, decrease uh, means a little volume decrease now see so this time also the volume decrease now
so after music we learned that how can we add two screens here like this is only one screen how can we add here two four so many screens so like here we add this uh, happy rabbit effect uh, or animation then uh, like this way we can also add here two screens how let me import some videos here uh, is not here this one flowers.mp4 now i want it with this birds view so you have to drag it not click on this add button drag it to this second uh, box uh, means track so now after Placing it, you have to place it where you want this video, like here in this corner. Now let's see from beginning. Let me mute this this one and now see. This both videos are playing here. And after adding two screens we learn that uh, how can we add uh, a title here not an image a title here using this uh, with clipper application like this so here are some images you can choose any like this one and here's the title now you can also add here some text so here are some uh, videos i don't want it and if you want only a little background and uh, then if you want to add your own text you can do this also you can choose any background from here which you want and then you can uh, type some text onto this backgrounds so how can we export the video this is the last topic of our today's video so now uh, you have to click on this export button after uh, creating or editing your video then you have to select this video option if you want to save it as a video and then you have to choose the format how you want to save it and then there's audio also you can also save it as any audio so I will choose video here you have to rename it and then browser place you can uh, give her uh, quality and then say export it will start exporting so friends our today's all to be finished. Thanks for watching. Bye friends.